is not reasonable, be reasonable because it amounts to an outright ban. But here we value life from conception to the casket. New tonight at 11, a six week abortion ban is moving forward in Florida. So this bill now on its way to Governor Ron DeSantis's desk in the state legislature. Republicans and Democrats sparred over the abortion bill. At the same time, protesters brought their fight inside the Capitol after spending the week outside. So if this is signed into law, the bill would reduce the current 15 week ban to six weeks and violators could face a third degree felony. Now there are exceptions that includes rape, incest and human trafficking up to 15 weeks. Beyond that, there are other exceptions for fatal fetal conditions. And right now, the 15 week abortion ban is being challenged. It's in the hands of the Florida Supreme Court. And I spoke tonight with our legal analyst, Curtis Fallgatter, Fallgatter who says there's a provision in this newly passed six week ban that says it won't take effect until the Florida Supreme Court rules on the 15 week ban. The permutations are if the Supreme Court denies the 15 week ban, then this statute is dead in the water. If the Florida Supreme Court approves the 15 week ban, then now they'll have to deal with challenges to the six week ban. You know, that'll take time because the appellate courts and particularly Supreme Courts have a heavy docket. But I would think all that would be resolved sometime later this year. Yeah, it's not going to drag on that long. Now, the six week abortion ban passed largely along party lines in a 70 to 40 vote with the majority of Republicans voting in favor of the ban. No word yet on when Governor Ron DeSantis is expected to sign this legislation.